Hello friends, in this video we are going to see how mass transaction works in SAP. So first I am I'm planning to use sales or I will uh, I will take sales orders and I want to change certain field values in sales order. So for that I am uh, I'm going to take open sales order list here. So I have a couple of sales order and then I will show you how to navigate to the mass transaction and then open required fields mass you can see here object type click on this you can change all this uh, for vendor master data customer master data you can use all this other object types so for for sales order I'm going to take this all object type and then click on execute so it's a warning information continue so here these are the tables it will be updating so there is one more tab here fields click on that so here we have fields which field we need to update you can select multiple fields or just as a field whichever you require so for me I need to update shipping condition manually so I will select shipping condition and then click on execute again it's a warning so now do I have selection screen so here I need to give list of sales orders for which I need to do this mass change so I've entered so click on that execute now you see here right here it's highlighted what we are going to do is see whichever you can standard it is this way you can update select this column select this column and then click on this carry out a mass change it will update or if you want to change manually here you can do some changes so for this I need to update one and then click on save Yes, you can change the see the change log here. We have three warning messages. Yes, it's okay. Now let us go back and then execute that again. Now, if you see for these orders, we have 0202 and then the last one 0101. Similar way, you can do many of the fields in mass change. So this way you can update you can see you can search it from here if you know the technical name you can search it here or some text uh, say shipping condition or some LGO RT yes story location shipping point everything you can change it manually whichever the fields available in the sales order let us just check in the materials so customers will check so customers we can update mainly uh, you can update regions or if you have a list of customers where you need to cross check the region and then country code everything you can change here or especially if you have some tax code you need to update tax code So tax classification tax K1 sorry If 
I know that, let me check. KNVI. Yes. If you see a tax classification, KN, this field you can update here. Usually, these are the fields you can update here through mass transaction. Let us go and check in mass material master. Materials, industry, and retail different. All the master data related, material related, you can update here. All and one thing I need to tell you. So with this master data and also you can extend the materials also. You see here, right? can search with some technical name MARD MARD yes With this tab you can also extend the material master you see here you have materials and then you want to do extend the material from one story location to other story location you can give the list of materials here and then give the reference plant and story location then it will extend your material to multiple story locations thank you